as I think Rem. MIBR is above Fury. No, you're Rem. trolling. <laughs> MIBR is Rem. not better than Furia. <laughs> A Never está dando quase 150 VPs para quem criar uma conta na plataforma e completar o onboard. Você também ganha mais 475 convidando um amigo com seu código. E isso tudo além de aulas com personalidade do cenário para evoluir ainda mais na sua gameplay. E agora a Never também tem a função Encontre o Do, que vai te ajudar a achar alguém no seu elo para te ajudar nessa caminhada até o Radiante. Lá tem guias de pixels em todos os mapas. E quem é assinante Never tem direito a uma análise de POV mensal, onde um coach profissional vai analisar sua gameplay. E te dar um feedback do que você pode melhorar direto no WhatsApp E pra você colocar tudo isso em prática A Neverest tem campeonatos mensais super organizados com live stream oficial E usando o cupom SMOKEME de 15 você tem 15% de desconto Pra ter acesso a isso tudo O link tá aqui na descrição Fala galera, tudo bem com vocês? A primeira semana da Liga das Américas foi um verdadeiro sucesso Os times brasileiros surpreenderam muita gente e desempenharam muito bem Inclusive os gringos do Play Chat sofreram pra montar a list da primeira semana da Liga das Américas e debateram bastante sobre Fúria e MBR. Inclusive ficaram em dúvida entre Loud e Leviathan para estar no top 1 do tier. E não conseguiram decidir. Tiveram que fazer um cara ou coroa, saca só. Give... I'd be happy with Cloud9 above MIBR, but I'd also yeah. don't care that much. I, I think Cloud9 8th, MIBR 7th makes sense. Oh, put it down. Let's are we split 50-50 here? Why are we so are we? high up on Fúria? Because why, why are we so why high would, up what? on Fury? <laughs> Fury yeah. are better than these teams. Are you want to put Fury in seventh Furia. to tenth? I feel like Fury didn't play that well against Crew, even though they won. No, they, they didn't play on them. Okay, they they didn't play well on Crew's map pick. That's probably quite far towards the bottom of Fury's which, map pool. Which, I think which is also where also, Kesnick can play raise and they can go it's crazy. It's playground. Kesnick's playground is probably also, the only map that Crew can play. We have very like I think in our heads, we. Are rating Fury as like the best of the worst teams right now because they played Fnatic, the winners of Lock in close on one map, where they forced Fnatic to adapt to a really weird comp that I think actually has no legs once you actually prep for it. I'm talking about the Haven Viper shit. Yeah, I don't but think I, that's the reason. But the, qu the question are though is, are now? Fury better than those other four teams? I don't and think so. I think you don't. Surely I think not. Be as, I think might be as above. Fury. No, you're Rem. trolling. <laughs> MIBR is Rem. not better than Furia. Furia versus Fnatic Haven game. That's all you need to know, bro. That's all you need to remember. No. Add on your brain. Saying that he's Add on your broken brain. No, that game has blinded people, I think. Why? It, it was goaded. It was fun to watch in the moment, but it was Fnatic. MW played Fnatic. insane. And, and you already have better against... players than MIBR as well. If you're just doing it based off like player quality or expectations, you would expect that Fury team to be better. It's not like I it's have not liked like they're what supposed I've seen to of be MIBR shit. more than what I've seen of Fury recently. It's one game. MIBR just in fact that's a, that's even more just going off one data point because MIBR were only good at the, the no the game that they lost by the way the game I'm that thinking, they lost yeah <laughs> I saw I saw I On saw potential map? in them before oh, two maps, lock in as well I know but. Come on, that was the. I, I listen, it's one it's versus reasonable. three. You guys get your way. Yeah, you can have your yeah. six to Thank ten. Thank you. Thank you. You guys get your way. I appreciate. But it. I, but I do think it's reasonable to put Furia next, even though they might be cap. better than cap. Hundred Thieves and Sentinels. No cap. Well, then why are you putting? It? <laughs> what? No, 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 no. I, I'm saying what, what? I'm saying it's possible, but I don't think the mm. Fury should be in fourth. Yeah. I think Fury should be there, and then Hundred Thieves should be above them. I think Hundred Thieves have demonstrated more in the past, albeit with their this, all the roster, break. to have more faith in them. There's I a think tier there's break a, after six. Yeah. I think there's a tier no, break. No, there isn't a tier break between Hundred Thieves and Furia. They haven't demonstrated that. No, no, no. That there's a tier yet. break between Furia and MIBR. I think, and then the Sentinels of Hundred Thieves, oh. Furia, and then there's a top three. I think there's a top three tier break. Middle three, tier break, bottom four. I would agree with that, but I think that Bren thinks Furia belongs in the bottom <laughs> of the pack. Bren a coin flip. Heads is loud, <laughs> tails is Leviathan. Oh, well, tails, tails already won. Heads wins. Heads wins. Heads wins. Free. Fuck. All right. Well, there you go. Fuck Let's off. go. go. Fuck off. Let's go. I love this actually arguing my show. points. Yeah, this is fucking amazing. I love it. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Real analysis. <laughs> coin flip wins. Pois é, e assim ficou a tier list final do Play Chat, levando em consideração as partidas da primeira semana da Liga das Américas. Mas e o que você achou do debate deles entre Fury e MBR, quem você acha que está melhor? E sobre Loud e Leviathan, quem você colocaria no top 1? Deixe a sua opinião aí nos comentários, deixe também aquele like, se inscreve no canal para não perder nada. Aquele abraço e até o próximo vídeo.